Kenmore has major history in learning to ski. You know, way back from the, the time when the Snyders came over here and started the Alberg Technique and brought on what ski schools should be like back then. And now it has transitioned into a snow sports school because of snowboarding and skiing and pally skiing. Um, and about six years ago, we took our snow sports school and turned it into a terrain-based learning center. What that means is we started to build elements that instead of making people stop and learn to stop and be afraid to go fast, it's kind of we built elements in the snow that contain their speed and built confidence and we never tell them to slow down now because they won't go fast. What the elements do, we start out on the flats and that's just to get people balanced and sliding knowing what their equipment is, walking around, moving actually. After they're comfortable with doing that and being standing in a balanced position, we move to what we call a half pipe. It definitely does not look like the half pipes in terrain park. It's a very, very mild, shallow half pipe. And what they learn to do here is they do drop into the half pipe and they just get to understand that if they're balanced, they can ride the half pipe all the way through. And the other side, there's a little hill, so they don't worry about stopping. From there, we move to the Magic Carpet, which we've built some very first turns, they're called. They're bank turns that basically we have people aim for the top of the turn, and the turn will just guide them through the turn so that they're not going fast and they go from one turn to the other. Comfortable there. After that, um, we might stop at the rollers, which are just some big banks that we let people roll up. Again, there's a stop wall, and they, again, they get used to moving on their skis and being balanced when your ski is moving. From there, we progress to our traverse track. There are seven turns, and if I went up there, stood on my skis, closed my eyes, and just let gravity take me down, I would just stop glide through the turns. They're magic. And what they let people do is to start experimenting and feeling what's happening on their skis and getting more confidence, because as they do it, they tighten up the arcs of the turns. The last element is the perfect slope, and it looks like a bowling alley lane with sides on it. That's their master. If they can make it down there, um, they're well on their way to skiing. Um, and what the sides do, it just kind of encourages the, the turn to happen so they're not headed straight down the hill. And they're off and hopefully they're going to stay the rest of the day and play in the elements and build up some skills and confidence without, you know, they're just successful so they want to stay out there and do it. So we want everybody to have a good experience when they come to Clearmore whether they're in snow sports school or they're gonna try it on their own. So let, we'll help you out.